like we're gonna be seeing uh, me brawler first. Some rock, oh, they, paper, scissors. They're actually doing the rock, paper, scissors thing. For, no, for ultimate, we should make it rock, paper, scissors, lizard, lizard Spock. <laughs> That's a thing. I did not know that. Three, yep. Two, one, but too lengthy to go into on this on this stream. Hey. With five rock, paper, scissors options, we are now rocking five potential sets between these two players. <laughs> we got Aquatic versus Zeith, Me Brawler and Fox on Town and City. Zaitha using the platforms to, 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 to camp and to charge. Aquatic recognizing that that is what he wants to do. He's tacking on that pressure. He's saying, you're charging, but you ain't charging for free. You're charged, if you charge, then I charge you for that. Yeah, Ooh. the ledge right now is a very scary spot. These guys are still in neutral. Aquatic is now shown that he will opt for side B. It'll be interesting to see how Zeith reacts. Miffed neutral B read. It's a, a, a faint jump. Very nice pressure from Aquatic. He's kind of dancing around him a lot. Made Zeith kind of scared to uh, hold shield for fear of getting tomahawked. Oh, no. Oh, no. That was a nasty display. That's very unfortunate. But just like that, Aquatic's going to take game one. All right, my ride's going to be in a few minutes, so I should get going. Good commentating with you, Bones. Appreciate having you on. We're running it back to town and city. That nair was kind of dangerous. Water doing a really good job. Kind of holding the hand for the side bees. Scythe recognizing that he might be able to get some kind of conversion off of a near tech chase. Water recognizing that he might not have been able to push it further with the drift. Both of these players doing it. Ooh! That was a nasty call out from Scythe. Like, you're gonna push something here. It's not happening. Very nice spacing for side B. So if I'm right here, that option is not available to you. In the back here. Not respecting these paint jumps. Goes for the lower middle forward air. Kind of cross him up. Now he's got Aquatic on the ledge. Very dangerous spot. Aquatic doing a very good job moving around it. Going going for a fair footstool attempt, not quite connecting it. Side so taking that opportunity to throw him back off stage yet again. There to cover it up. Attempted to frame with the down tilt. Not quite. A call out for the back air space. Not quite getting that tech chase. Up B. Zeith attempting to try and close it out right then, right there with that up B. Not quite handling it. Aquatic bringing it back. Very nice tech chase. Nice way to even up the game again. Aquatic staggering his hits, but he's getting a little antsier. Scythe is also struggling to find a strong aerial opening. Opting to charge the fist a little more. Oh, that'll do it. It's a good fair footstool. Recognizing that custom bead brawler actually doesn't have very good vertical recovery options. Realizing he won't be able to come back from that. 
and it is up 2-0 aquatic. Survival! Roy! And there's the Roy switch. Running back game three to town and city. Three, two, one, go! Dynamic of the match will have shifted a bit. Aquatic recognizing. Recognizing that his aerial pressure isn't as scary. He's being a little more gusto with uh, aerial stuffing. He's unable to make it back. Aquatic recognizing that Roy doesn't have Roy doesn't have very good get off me options for this kind of pressure. He's taking advantage of that, using it. And that'll do it anyway. Got the fair, no, not even a knee to the footstool. And Aquatic takes it 3-0 over Zythe.